Hello guys, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how to change the configuration of a part in SOLIDWORKS. So let's start a new part file. Click OK. And let's just draw a cylinder. So I'll select sketch. And I can draw it on the right plane. I'm just going to draw a circle. Add a dimension. Dimension is going to be 5. And let's go to feature, extrude it. And it is going to be, let's extrude it 10 and click OK. OK, so now we have a cylinder that is 5 in diameter and 10 inch long. Let's say you now need another cylinder that is 10 inch in diameter and 15 inch long. Um, you won't have to create a new part file and create that cylinder. You can just add that configuration within this part. So you can have one part that has multiple dimensions for one part. And I'll show you what I mean by that. So to create a new configuration, let's come to the configuration manager tab. Click that. And down here, right click. Make sure you are not selecting this. Because when you select this, it is going to want to add a derived configuration. But Make sure you are not selecting that and down here, right click and select add configuration. And let's just give our configuration a name. I'll call this 10 inch. And click OK. So now we have the 10 inch configuration. And make sure you are in the 10 inch configuration. You can tell you are in it by the green check. The first one we create is the default. And the new configuration we create is the 10 inch. Now let's go back to the feature manager tree. We would click on the drop down and edit our sketch. And for this new configuration, we want to change the diameter to 10. So to do that, we will select this sketch. We'll select this sketch dimension. And it will give you these dimensions properties. And select configuration and change it to this configuration. So we are saying in this configuration, click OK. We want to change this dimension to 10. And click OK up here. And exit the sketch. And to change the length, we want to change the length in this configuration to 15. We are going to right click on the feature, edit the feature, and we are saying in this configuration, we want to change this dimension to 15. Select OK. And that is all you need to do. So let's go back to the configuration manager. So we are in 10. When we click on our default, you say it shrinks. When we click on our 10 inch configuration, it changes. So that is how you change configuration in SOLIDWORKS. To change the dimensions in the feature, this is how you do it. Go back to the feature manager tree. For the feature, right click on it, select configure feature, and you'll see the two dimensions here. You can change it to whatever number you want, and you can even add more configurations down here. To change the configuration dimensions for the sketch, right click on the sketch again, configure feature, and you also see those dimensions here. You can change it and add more configuration as you want. And once you are done, click OK. This is how you change configuration in SOLIDWORKS. Thank you and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye.